Hey everyone, Unreal Engine 5.3 has made a great addition to PCG. You can now sample physical materials natively, which allows you to easily create a PCG that reacts to auto materials. So you can simply sculpt up your environment and the PCG will react automatically. Just refresh it. There you go, it's newly populated. All right, let me show you how to do this. I'm going to create a new PCG volume. I won't bother with a blueprint for this one. I'll just be going fast. And in the PCG, I will start with a world ray hit query. And for this, you just want to select this new checkbox, get reference to physical material. Now you can plug this into a surface sampler. And from there, well, we can see let me drag this into the world and expand it a little bit. If I look at this surface sampler now, if I scroll off to the right, I see the physical material. And it's a little daunting. It's giving you the entire path to the physical material, but uh, let me show you a trick to handle that. Point filter. I'm going to split out the various physical materials with a couple different point filters. And for that, I'm going to say operator substring. Target attribute is going to be physical material. I'll use a constant threshold type string. And let's see what my physical materials are named. I've got PM sand, PM cliff, and PM snow. So I'm just going to type PM underscore sand in here. And because I have substring selected, I've got my sand. Substring is going to search for a string value in the attribute that you're filtering on. In this case, I'm searching for PM sand within physical material. So now I can simply do the same thing for PM, let's say, snow. And the remaining one will be the cliff. All right, let's debug. There's our sand. There's our snow. And there is our cliff. And from here, you can create static mesh spawners to do whatever you need to do. All right, enjoy.